Hey everyone, Coach Mall and Coach Tiff here, and we are so pumped to present to you some awesome things that Coach Tiff has been working around the clock on in regards to our Zen Planner app. She has been building out all of our workouts daily into the Zen Planner app so that we can track our results. Because when you track results, you see results, right, Tiff? Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And the cool part are all the awesome capabilities that come with the Zen Planner app when we are tracking our workouts. You can uh, build out what your workout was for the day. You can create notes. You can um, type in more detail of what you actually did or how you modified your workout. And then the cool thing is, is your buddies can see what you post and then they can comment, give you thumbs up cheer you on and you can do the same for them, which is really cool. So with that said, we really want to encourage everyone to start really utilizing the workout portion of the Zen Planner app. And in doing so, we are launching a February workout tracker app challenge. So we're going to recognize the top three peeps in the Fuel House membership who are going into the daily workout and typing in their results, as well as commenting on other people's results and giving them thumbs up and high fives and really awesome positive messages. So we're going to watch your activity for the whole month of February. At the end of the month, we'll recognize our top three uh, members who have been utilizing the app the most. So here we go. And this is for virtual peeps as well. So what I'm going to do next, you guys, is I'm going to actually um, show you how, when you log into your app, what it's going to look like. Okay, so when you open up your app, your Fuel House Zen Planner members app, you can see the classes available. If you click on your profile picture in the upper left hand corner, a menu bar pops out. What you want to click on next is workouts. When you click on workouts, you can see the workout of the day. If there's something to track, you'll also notice a spot for that. So today we had back squats. So if you click on log results, you'll be able to enter the weight that you used for those different sets. If you have any notes that you want to type in about how today was, you're welcome to type those in. If you want it to be public and you want other people to be able to see it, then you leave it that public um, red. If you don't, you can click on it and then in, it won't be public. If you did it prescribed, also leave that part red so that Rx if you didn't do, a, do the workout prescribed, you can click that if you did some modifications. Um, otherwise, you can keep it red. Let's say you want to enter in your own custom result. Maybe you modified something that day. Maybe you did double kettlebell front squats instead of back squats. You can click on Add Custom Result. And then let's say you did double kettlebell Sometimes it takes a while to find it. Okay, so double kettlebell front squat, DBL, KV front squat. You can enter in how many sets and reps you did and what weights, okay? Every day, anytime there's something that you're tracking, if you click on the leaderboard at the top there, you can see if anyone has tracked it. If you click on that arrow, you'll be able to see the workout of the day for the rest of the week. Okay, so just click on that arrow at the top and it will show you the next days. So you'll always be able to see the full week starting on Sunday. You'll be able to see the rest of the week, all the, all the training sessions, and you'll be able to see anything that you're going to be able to record. Okay, next I'm going to show you how you can comment on someone else's results. So I'm going to actually pretend that I did this. I didn't do this today. I did something else, but... I'm going to say I did 100 pounds, 125, 125, and then 150, and I'm going to save it. So now if I click on leaderboard, you'll see my, my results there. I'm going to like it. I'm going to click on that like. So now you can see that there's one like. I'm going to comment on it. I'm going to say strong work and add that comment. So now what happens is if I go click on my profile in the upper left-hand corner again, and then I click on notifications, I can see that someone liked my result. So anytime you comment or like someone's 
um, leaderboard results, they'll be they'll get a notification. Any of the workouts that we listed as benchmarks are listed in this library under benchmarks. If you click on that drop down arrow, you can see other other exercises in the library. Um, but this is a good way to to go and check and see your past results. So if you want to see what your past results were, let's say you know you're going to be doing back squats. Maybe you'd go back and see what you've done for back squats in the past and check that out. Okay, so feel free to play around with that and reach out to me if you have any questions about anything. Cool. Thank you, Tiff, so much for all the work that you've been putting into helping us utilize the app more. Um, I've seen this in so many gyms and we're just finally really bringing it to our membership and utilizing it. And it's just a way of connecting with our community on a different level. So this is what Fuel House is all about. So let's use it.